Hello friends, this is Arun and welcome in my channel of Honest Creation. Today I will teach you how to make fire text in Photoshop. So let's see. So firstly go to file and take a new document and uh, click on OK. I want black, so fill it with black. Now put your text here. I want fire text. Mm, go to options of text. I want gray tone and uh, Phone name is Adobe Devnagri. That's fine. Now right click on there. Text layer. Go to blending options. Firstly go to outer glow. I want outer glow. And uh, color I want red. Click on OK. Mm size uh, I want I, it, it depends on your uh, file size uh, if you take mm, I want now color overlay and uh, this is the color code CD7E2E I want this color mm, now go to set in distance uh, I think 6 then size 6 mm, opacity 100 I want uh, that's fine. Mm, okay, now play with the size of this certain value. Mm, I want uh, color of this is 872D0F. Click on OK. Mm, now click on inner glow. I want inner glow. Mm, 100 opacity and uh, color dodge. Uh, blending mode I want. Mm, then uh, color I want uh, E5C23 then B mm. click on OK size mm. that's fine now click on OK now we are ready with the text and make a new layer and uh, select both layers text as well as blank layer and press ctrl E now this is the text layer and uh, make a new copy by pressing ctrl J now go to filter and then click on liquify uh, 17 brush size ok mm. uh, choose this first smudge tool mm. Okay, 17, 50 and 100 values are there and apply around the edges of the text uh, in between and uh, the outer part of the text like this mm, that's fine that's very fine okay that's fine Now we are ready with the liquify tool of fire. Mm, now click on OK. Now this is the result after applying the liquify tool. Now this is the fire image and uh, click on OK and I will crop the fire. Firstly rasterize it. Right click on there. Mm, firstly I have to make it large uh, by pressing Ctrl T. That's fine. Mm, OK. Now rasterize it. Go to channel. I want green channel and I'll control click on there and uh, take a selection and uh, that con press control J and you have the selection for uh, this fire mm, position it wherever you want mm, I want uh, that's fine 
make it zoom so that uh, we can put it in very correct position uh, okay so I think uh, I have to make it large mm. that's fine click on ok and uh, make a mask on there so that we can remove the uh, the extra portion from the fire Now make a copy of this fire again by pressing Ctrl J and uh, I want for E. Mm, okay, now again do the same thing and make a uh, apply brush on the mask so that I can remove the extra portion of the fire. Now we are ready with the mm, fire. This is before after. Now, now that's fine. Again, go to filter, then make it blur. Uh, I think uh, one point two. That's fine. Now click on OK. So mm, that's all right. Mm, okay. So make a new layer and uh, fill it with this dark orange, and apply a brush on there so that I can make a very dramatic result for fire. Uh, make it large, and I will try some blending options. Mm, no. I want oh that's fine and adjust its opacity this is before after very nice and make a new copy for text and move it to up and apply screen blending mode and reduce its opacity now you are ready with the text I hope you have enjoyed this video and keep in touch with us on our inscription as well as you can like our page and uh, moreover one thing I want to do mm, I want to match the color of this fire uh, that's fine and uh, okay okay that's fine thank you friends for watching this video have a nice day